Well, it's Friday. It's reaction time for Falcon and the Winter Soldier. So let's get everything set. <laughs> Just hit 200. Yes, folks, as you saw from that little intro there, I just hit 200 subscribers last night. Actually, uh, while, we're, while we're on the subject, let's see if my subscriber count has grown since that milestone was reached. Go to my <laughs> channel. Uh, 201. It's progress. It's progress. It's taken me just over three years to hit 200 subscribers. But nevertheless, hello, my fellow Dream Chasers, Kenzie Retro here. It's Friday, and that means it's reaction time. We're on time this week. We are, we are on yes, the day are. for the reaction. But <laughs> holy smokes, what the hell did we just witness in the last episode? I'm so excited. I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know. But legitimately, Dan, what the hell did we witness last week? Captain America, just Captain America murdering people, you know. Hashtag not my captain. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The, the, oh my word! I mean, uh, if you haven't seen how we reacted to that particular moment, playlist is in the. Uh, well, it's it's in it's in my it's in a reactions playlist. It's up it's up in the top right of your screen. I might actually get a playlist put together just for. I might get a separate playlist put together for. Uh, for this at some point. But nevertheless, episode five, entitled Truth. And we're going to see the aftermath of what just happened. There is apparently an after credit scene after this episode. Apparently, right. So we're definitely going to need to stay tuned apparently. for that. Yes, and I'm getting tuned. my nuggets. Yeah, we can. yeah. Uh, I've got chicken nuggets in the oven, uh, oven as well, folks. So they should be ready in a, in a couple of minutes' time. So, um, so... But uh, I, I will have I will have this on I will have the episode on in the background while I'm getting it all dished up. So nevertheless, here we you just have to part with me reacting to it for like it, two minutes. <laughs> it's it's fine. Yes. So anyway, uh, controllers at the ready. Three, <laughs> two, <laughs> one. Let's go. <gasps> here we go. How is it my subtitles never work? Sorry, just pause it a sec. Sorry. This should be a running gag. <laughs> there we go. You can play. <laughs> just to double check, what's your timestamps? There we go. What's your time stamp? So you tell us. I'm, 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 pretty, I'm pretty much back up to speed with you. you, know, you, know, you I was, I was just... I'm at 45 seconds. Yeah, we're, we're, yeah, we're fine. We're in sync. So, 49, 50, 51. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah. kicking off. Yeah. I'll say, I'll say, there's a, there's always one of a of a. I'll say, if it, it's like a it's like a, a hundred of those capsules. There's always one that's left not left uh, unscathed. Always. Here we go. And this. There we go. Yeah, I said, I said that, that that was a that was a cool shot there. The blood on the shield. Like I like said, that was a really cool shot there of the blood on the shield. Oh yeah, definitely. And the fact that they left the episode at that. I mean, I mean, 
j- just like when we were watch- just like when we were watching one division they they know how to get viewers hooked oh, yeah. for the next episode it's only taken them four episodes to do that though <laughs> four out of six oh. yeah oh here we go <clears throat> yep he's a got yep Uh oh. That shield's got to be sharp, though, surely. Jesus. It has to be. If it was able to do that sort of damage. Mm. Goodness. Yeah, it's, it's, it's that realization. What the f- have I done? Yep. And the and the one time he makes the wrong decision, everyone's there to see it. Yep. Oh. Uh-oh. Here we go. Do you want to do this? Yes, I really do. You saw what happened. You know what I had to do. I killed him because I had to. He killed Lamar. He didn't kill Lamar, John. Don't go down that road. Believe me, it doesn't end well. I'm not like you. But you're pretty damn close to it, Walker. Definitely. I don't want anyone else to get hurt. John. Uh oh. You gotta give me a shield, man. Here we go. You want it? Come get it. Effectively, yes. So that's what this is. Uh oh. You almost got me. You made a mistake. You don't want to do this. Yeah, we do. Here we go, Civil War. Yes! Call back to Civil War, baby! Oh, nope! Oh, yeah! <laughs> it really is a callback to Civil War because if yeah. you remember what Tony said if you remember what Tony said he was like you don't have the right to carry that shield that's not yours yeah and that he was like my dad made it for you yeah so there was, so there, was there was one particular exchange between uh, Tony and Steve it was like yeah he, he was he was my fr- uh, he was my friend so was I. Oh, oh, oh shoo! Wow! That's Bucky's vibranium arm up in smoke. Hmm. We could have been team. <laughs> Oh, cool. Oh, okay. Ooh. Who's going to be first to grab it? Whoa, okay. Uh, Bucky, are you okay? Yeah. 
Oh. 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 Yikes. That's it. Heel turn confirmed. That is a that yeah, that's the heel turn complete. Oh. oh come on, Bucky, be okay. Oh that is oh. what the oh. <laughs> Sheesh. Did he just break Walker's arm? It's over. It's Walker's <laughs> arm! Oh, wow. That was a hit. <laughs> yep, he's out for the count. Yeah, that shield's definitely going to need to get cleaned. As if it wasn't obvious enough. Bucky, what the hell? What? Just, he gave he gave him the shield, but he's just walked off. What the hell? Well, he's probably going to be mad at Sam because he's thinking if you just just kept the shield, this would have never happened. They, yeah, that, that's a valid point. It, a valid point. That that'll explain why he walked away. But I say, I say Sam, you're gonna need to clean that shield. You're he's probably going to think you've really let Steve down. That's what Bucky's going to think anyway. Okay. He's going to yeah. be like, there's your shield. Now hurry up and just become Captain America. Yeah. He's going to be like, it's your neck. It's now your time. Take yeah. the mantle. All right. Back in a couple of ticks, folks. So if I'm going to have a kick, cat. <laughs> Deal when you're having to use a coffee table to prop your green screen up, folks, to prevent it from falling down your chair. We all have budgets, man. Yep. Wait, yo, you forgot the wings. Okay. But if, if I had one of those green screens that's like, you know, those, you know, this uh, green screen, you know, the way those old projector screens, those. What those do you ones. feel down? Yeah. You know, those ones. If I had, if yeah. I had a green screen similar to that, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be having to worry about this. I don't know if you just saw what happened, by the way, but uh, Torres went to Falcon. He's like, he's like, oh, what about your wings? Because they're in the bag, and he just said, keep them. 
Wow. He's just walked, he's just walked away with the shield and not his wings. There you go. Yeah. It's it's there for the world to see. He has just been stripped of the right to be Captain America. Circumstances of the incident have been considered. Yeah, Falcon's just given up his wings. Damn. Yeah. He was just like, just keep him. Viewer discretion, do not smoke. I mean, that, I mean that, that's huge. Yeah. yeah. So, he'll have him back, though, for Captain America. Though. So, oh. Yeah, a, a, a lot has happened in the first, in the last, like, 15 minutes, and I'm including the last three or four minutes of the lo- previous episode. Yeah. This Hoskins, is what I've wanted the past four episodes. Yeah. Hoskins <laughs> dead. Walker kills a guy that didn't kill Hoskins. Yeah. Sam gives up his wings. Yeah. And now Walker's been stripped of the title of Captain America. And that's all, in the, span of, that's all in effectively the span of uh, a 15 minute runtime, effectively. Hold no rank in retirement and receive no benefits. Damn. No rank and no benefits. He's now U.S. agent. He's now officially U.S. agent. Watch. And you called that right back at the end of the first episode. Not anymore. He's going to become U.S. agent. You called that right at the start, right at the end of the first episode. Yep. <laughs> I wonder if Haywood's going to have some involvement. Wait, no, he got arrested in one division, didn't he? Yeah. What if he teamed up with Zemo? As a US agent. Oh, that would be a juicy final battle for next week. Oh, yeah. yeah. But I want to see Sam as Captain America. Oh. But I reckon... I reckon the last shot. I reckon the last shot of next week's episode is going to be, you know, the one where you see Falcon throwing the shield at the tree, and they're just both like, um, they both do the bro shake, and then they go their separate ways. I reckon that's going to be the end of last week's episode. Allegra de Fontaine. Actually, it's Contessa Valentina Allegra de Fontaine. You know, it's hard. Just got to feel it. I don't like to repeat myself. You just call me Val, but don't call me Val. Just keep it in your head. So they seem where they're in the back garden or somewhere or something like that. Look, I reckon it'll be his sisters as well. Yeah. Wait, she would have done the same? I mean, he would have been doing him a favor if he'd he taken out the whole... He just said he didn't but kill Hoskins. Here we go. This is where he's going to be U.S. agent. Called it. You did the right thing. Taking the serum. Yeah, of course I know about that. I'll tell you something. I said that he took the setup. Look, off screen. Took yeah. the <coughs> damn serum off screen. Second yeah. best choice you've ever made in your life. Oh, you want to know what the first best choice was? Oh, Ty was mirroring this fabulous firecracker sitting right next to me. How's it going? Okay. Picking the phone when I call you. Oh, by the way. Don't worry about the shield. I know you don't have it. Here's a little dirty state secret. Oh. It doesn't really belong to the government. Mm. Great area. I'll be in if I, See, had any, if I had any beverages in my mouth at that point, that would it would be a classic comedic trope of just what? <laughs> Nothing on the card that she gave him. Yep. <clears throat> well, the new Mortal Kombat film was meant to come out uh, today, but it got pushed back to the 23rd. Oh. But rest assured, folks, there will be a review of it. Of, of, 
Because I've got, I've got a, I've got a growing list of films that I need to watch for from 2021, so I can get my top 10 films of the year. Mortal Kombat's one of the top of my list, definitely. From the trailer, that's what I want from the film. How many times do you have to pay for that lives just to be citizens of this goddamn planet? The movement is ready. They're not going to stop. Not unless you make them. It's time. That doll looks very familiar. I'm pretty sure I've seen that doll somewhere before. Sokovia. Didn't Sokovia get... Wasn't Sokovia um, destroyed in Age of Ultron? Yeah, that'd just be a memoriam. That'll be why the water's all there, I think. Oh, right, okay, that explains it. It's cold. Imagine my relief. Here we go. Yeah, I think that would be why there's all water there because Sokovia got lifted up into the sky and dropped and then, back down. And then it disintegrated on the way back down. Once, yeah. Just, oh, it's cold. Thank you. Literally programmed to kill her. Just do what needs to be done. Carly has people everywhere. There's only one way to make sure she cannot continue her mission. Appreciate the advice. We're going to do it our own way. Yeah. For some reason, the statue feels like an Easter egg for one division. Because obviously, you've got the two parents, one daughter, one child. Kind of. I doubt it. I highly doubt it. But maybe it, it could. Be, it could very well be. Because obviously everybody knows Wanda is the Scarlet Witch and she managed to, she was part of the Avengers battle in Endgame. So maybe it's a monument for her and her family, possibly. Possibly. I don't know. Wow. What? Maybe I'm looking too much into it. Ah, oh, the trailer. The magazine was empty. The trailer shot. The magazine. Finally, was... carries Bucky's final character. Yeah, yeah, out. you're right. You're right about the statue. You're right about the statue. Because everybody would know that she was part of the fight with Thanos. Yeah. So maybe they're just like, we'll build a statue in her memory for saving the world. Yeah. Or maybe that he's just the president of Sokovia, or it could just be that. Who knows. Oh, and off he goes to Wakanda. We will take you to the raft. Oh! So they're taking oh. him back to prison. They're taking him back to prison. <laughs> Fair enough. Ayo's awesome. I'm still intrigued as to how they're going to tackle Black Panther 2 without Chadwick Boseman. There's a petition currently for recasting Chadwick Boseman at the moment. Oh, good grief. No, you can't recast. You cannot recast Chadwick Boseman's character. You need to at least... I'm, I'm very much on the side of, like, Chadwick would... I think Chadwick would want He'd want to be remembered as Black Panther, but he wouldn't want them to stop making Black Panther movies just because he's passed. So I think he'd want them to recast, to be honest. I think either, he'd that, be... either that or go with the comics yeah, and have whatever her name is take up sure, the mantle. He... That's the you one. could do that, yeah, which would be cool. But like at the same time, like, I mean, for, the, for example, Heath Ledger, he passed away. They made a new Joker. Um, there's other actors that have passed away and they've made new roles. So 
Oh, and I, oh, yeah. okay. I mean, I mean, there's there's so many we could be here all day with that. I mean, I mean, I mean, yeah. Dumbledore, Richard Harris passed away. Michael Gambon took up the mantle. Exactly. So I don't see because Chadwick's passed. Yeah, it is very very sad and it's a real shame. But the, I don't think that recasting him should be ruled out. I think that like it, it would be okay, but just have it like in memory of Chadwick Boseman at the end. Black Panther too. Like have it in memory of him. Or have like a tribute to Chad- Chadwick Boseman, yeah. like they did with Stan Lee at the end of Endgame. Do that. That would be that'd be really nice. Yeah. Also, no, the, 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 tribute, the tribute to Stanley was actually the opening, uh, the opening of uh, Captain Marvel. Yeah, there was the opening of Captain Marvel, but when Endgame re- re-released. Oh, they, that, uh, yeah. Yeah, they had a uh, little tribute to him. So do that for Black Panther too, by all means. But have like, for example, I think Denzel Washington was originally supposed to be Black Panther Ooh. like years, years ago. I think he'd be amazing, but I don't Denzel, know Denzel, I can get now. behind. I don't know what he'd be like now. Like, huh? there are many actors that you could cast as like the new Black Panther. Yeah, but I say, I say Denzel, I can get behind. I mean, I mean, some, I mean, a couple, a couple of films involving Denzel, I really enjoyed, Crimson Tide, and Remember the Titans. I think there was a film called Flight as well, though, where he played yes, a, that one as well. Alcoholic pilot, which yeah. was good. I say, pretty sure he got nominated for um, for a number of awards for that role. Yeah. And Chadwick has huge respect for Denzel Washington. So there maybe have go. the role. Per- perfect opportunity right there. So if anything, if you really want to have it in his memory, cast Denzel Washington. But I don't know if he's too old for the role. That's the only thing. Valid point. Yeah. But you've got CG and things like that. So maybe... Mm. Or maybe there could be a story where he was the original Black Panther before his father, before... Um, Charles's father. Sorry. Or you could just do a Marvel What If multiverse. You could do a multiverse Black Panther where he's the Black Panther of another universe. Now that that's yeah, opened up to us. Yeah, I don't think Denzel would work as a Black Panther now. He's uh, he's 66. He's, he still looks good though, don't get me wrong. But Oh yeah. Go back to these days where it was like training Training day. <laughs> Training day. Oh, there's there's another one I can add to my list. Go back to that era of Denzel and say, "Hey, you want to be Black Panther?" <laughs> <laughs> but he did the Equalizer. To be fair, so he's done action movies. So there you go. He's still doing it. So maybe, maybe I don't know. I don't know how people would feel about it. Though. Yeah, because because of course his age is going to be one of the biggest barriers for taking up the role. Yeah. Well, so Chadwick did sign up for multiple movies, obviously knowing that he had cancer, sadly. Yeah. So I don't think they want them to stop making Black Panther movies just because he's passed. Yeah. If anything, it would probably upset him. Maybe they could end up using unused footage for yeah. some flashback scenes. Yeah, flashback scenes, yeah. There you go. Opportunities right there. Yeah, or so you could cool. what would be amazing is you know how he goes into you know when he has like the Black Panther ritual where um, he goes off into the sort of like land um, I can't oh, remember that one yeah he walked on and shown up as like Black Panther from the afterlife because his dad shows up yes. and like I don't know though I, I don't know I mean, that'd be the least, like, offensive way possible, by the way. I think it'd just be really nice. Oh, or just have him show up, like, in Return of the Jedi as, like, a full, <laughs> as, like, a full ghost. <laughs> Mr. Bradley, though. Mr. Bradley, you gotta do something. We gotta tell somebody. No more. Leave me dead. My name is Barry. But the world's different now. I know people. Man, that's why you're here. You think things are different? You think times are different? You think I wouldn't be dead in a day if you brought me out? You won't believe jail was my fault because you got that white man's shoe. 
they were worried my story might get out. So they erased me, my history. But they've been doing that for 500 years. <laughs> yeah, they've... Like, like, this is another case. This is another brilliant case of how grounded these sort of yeah. scenes are, grounded in reality. Because yeah. And if they did, no self respecting black man would ever want to be. What's it going to do now? Hmm? So what's Sam going to do now? What if he calls up Bucky and says, do you want to be Captain America? I don't know. Oh, he's called Sarah. Mm. He could do with a break, to be honest. <laughs> I think he needs a little, like, downtime with the family. Yeah, definitely. I mean... He's been through a lot. Though. I think it's yeah. Scary. I mean, I'm gonna go home now. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we we went all the way from him working for the Air Force at the start of the first episode to all of this. Well, he's just had to put up with three episodes of just doing constant things. Mom said we can't say. What? She's too messed up. Mister Jen said he wouldn't buy because it costs more to fix. Then he said something else from Vietnamese. Yeah. <laughs> Why didn't you say something? Because I didn't want to tell you guys tonight when we were looking all sad at Puppy Dog in the rain. In a rough day. You mean with Isaiah Brad? And what they did to him. You want to talk about it? No. Time to figure out what it all means. Okay, well, I'm here. But as far as the boat is concerned, bottom line is Mr. Dent backed out. I don't know what to do. Parts along that are going to eat up most of what we get back. Listen, don't worry. I'm going to fix the boat. Aren't you supposed to be off saving the world? Why are you back here bothering me? Because my family's well being is a part of the world. Oh. So you're waiting for a lead? I am. The government stepped in and took control and kind of benched us. Oh, hey guys. Please make sure Bennett and Ellie each get one, okay? Okay. All right. Bye. Bye. Have a good day at school, guys. Okay. Bennett and Ellie's dad cannot get up before noon. Kids keep showing up hungry, but are too proud to ask for any help. You're just like mom, feeding every kid in the neighborhood. Now, how many people still owe mom and dad something? All of them. <laughs> it might be time to call in a few of those favors. I'm gonna fix the stamp boat. Ooh. Okay. Hey, Sam Wilson. And the community comes together to help fix the boat. It's like New Asgard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was uh, End of Ragnarok. Thanks so much, man. Hey, look, y'all. Yeah. Word goes out to both of you, fellas. Yeah, we still got to build a useful service. How do we get it off the truck? <laughs> <laughs> hey! Bucky! Yeah! Bucky, my man! Captain Bucky, oh, hell! Yeah. <laughs> Sign for it on the. I called in a favor from the 
Seinfeld. Wait, Seinfeld. Is this gonna be Steve's like Wakandan shields? Oh, that's not good. I'm hoping it's Steve's Wakandan shields when he became Nomad. Oh, that would be cool. Evacuate the so. cities, engage all our defenses, so. and get this man a shield. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> there you go. I didn't use a metal arm. Well, I don't always think of it in you. It's my turn. It's nice. Oh. Want any help? <laughs> oh. Uh oh. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I love Sandri actually was like, no. He's like, yeah, don't go do there. Not, don't, don't you dare. Don't, don't you dare get any ideas. He's a friend from work. <laughs> <laughs> this is nice to see. I like this. I like scenes like this. Yeah. I like scenes like this. Just seeing them like chill and do things. I really want it to be Steve's with Conan Jules. I really want it to be them. Beer in a Marvel TV show? No, I'm, I'm joking. <laughs> Oh, it's yeah, not the zero percent alcohol one. I, I was, I was about to, I was about to, uh, which begs the question of, I'll say that they would have done something to get the Heineken Zero beer into the actual Heineken bottles. Yeah, <laughs> I was, I was, they would have had like some sort of funnel. Oh yeah, they would have filtered the air or like yeah. yeah. Or maybe they're or, like. Or maybe, or maybe they just. Uh, <laughs> Uh, actually, it might be a little bit more complex than that. They they would have uh, like Maybe. switched. They would have switched the labels. Yeah. Maybe it says zero percent on it. Maybe yeah. it is the zero percent one. Uh, no, I'm, I'm I'm pretty sure the zero one has like uh, so like some blue yeah, on the label oh. somewhere. Yeah. I don't know why that's a huge thing, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, but uh, <laughs> but, yeah. So, but of course they would they wouldn't have. Uh, I mean, surely they wouldn't have been allowed to actually drink alcohol on set. During those scenes. No, like when it, when it comes to working on set, I don't think you're allowed to have alcohol. Which work which works in my favor. He's in there. <laughs> I remember being on the set of Train uh, Train Spotting Two when the, we were shooting a scene for a. Uh, it was like for a scene that never made it to the film, where it was like all the younger versions of like the cast for like uh -huh. Train Spotting Two, and all the alcohol was just either like Coke or like fresh orange. It was like yeah. no alcohol on it, but it was shot in a club as if it was like alcohol and all that jazz. So yeah, I don't know if you're allowed to actually have alcohol on sets. Yeah. Each time I've worked anyway, all the alcohol's just, all the alcohol's either been fake or it's like, it, yeah, even the alcohol's just been fake basically. <clears throat> or it's just juice. And he would tell me every day what honor it was to be your partner. Oh. It meant the world to him. It's Lamar's family. <coughs> I'm sorry. Oh, <clears throat> <clears throat> 
and expect that post to be torn down. Oh, the, the, that that was a powerful cut. That truck. Finished? I can give you double this time. I promise you won't regret saying yes. So is she the power broker? <laughs> People are saying they think Sharon's going to be the power broker. Yeah. I don't know, maybe. <laughs> 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 oh. Oh. Fuck, he's still got his dog tags. Yeah. Is that the first? Maybe that's Steve's. First time I've noticed Bucky wearing dog tags. Yeah, maybe they're Steve's dog tags. Oh, that's a valid point. Steve Rogers had dog tags, so maybe they're his. Maybe. That's like he keeps that in memory of like Captain America. Sam Sam has the shield. Bucky has Sam the dog has tags. He, he gets to keep his dog tags. Huh. <clears throat> or maybe that happened off game in Endgame, where Steve was just like, "Here, I want you to have these." Maybe, it will, maybe. It's literally, it's so much like Bad Boys, it's great. Yeah. Okay, so. There should be a 316 bolt that goes in the big gear. No, 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 no. You didn't even look. I have to. Hi, sir. I told you, <laughs> I told you it's not the problem. Yeah, here you are. Yep. Samuel. In our defense, we were supposed to be done long before you woke up. I don't go to the sky to tell you how to barrel or whatever, so don't come down here and stop messing around with things you clearly don't understand. That's fair. That's fair. Wow. Oh. Thank you, gentlemen. Oh. Appreciate you. So that each time he's like, hi, Sarah, Sam's just like, you you stay away. You stay away from her. <laughs> oh, so it's not going to be in the last episode. Hey. Yeah, there's still about there's still there's still about fifteen minutes left. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Complicated, to say the least. You still told me what he was planning. I don't think either of us really understood what it felt like for the black man to be handed the shield. How could we? I don't apologize. I'm sorry. Thank you. Oh, man. Whatever happened with Walker wasn't your fault. Again, it. it's just that Shields, closest thing I've got left to a family. So when you retired, it made me feel like I had nothing left. You question everything. That's fair. You, Steve, me. That's fair. You know, I've got his. Uh, I just bought oh, oh, and uh, I just figured if it was to him, then it worked for me. I understand. But Steve is gone, and this might be a surprise, but it doesn't matter what Steve thought. <laughs> You gotta stop looking to other people to tell you who you are. (laughs) 
me ask you. You still having those nightmares? All the time. It means I remember. It means a part of me is still there. Which means a part of the little soldier's still in me. <laughs> but the good part. <clears throat> you up for a little tough love? You want to climb out of that hill you're in. Do the work. Do it. When you're making amends, you are avenging, you are avenging. Oh. <laughs> I love it. So, because you thought it would bring you closure. Good line. I like that. You go to these people and say sorry because <laughs> you think it'll make you feel better. Right? But you got to make them feel better. You got to go to them and be of service. I'm sure there's at least one person in that book who needs closure about something. And you're the only person who can give it to them. Probably a dozen. That's crazy. Cool. Start with one. Oh, come on. Well, good time. You know, you know the actress that played um, Malfoy's mum? Yeah. Uh, breaking, breaking news. She's uh, she passed away from cancer. She's just, uh, just, been, just, just been just been announced uh, yeah. Uh, just now. Yeah. And, uh, we're partners. She was also in Peaky Blinders. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, and and Skyfall for that matter. Oh. Thanks for that. Rest in peace. Oh, didn't expect that sort of news to be uh, popping up in these reactions. Yeah, they've gone their separate ways now. Right? And that, and that's that's the shot you that's the shot you mentioned earlier. I thought that was going to be at the end of next week's episode. Like that's how it was going to end, but we still got one episode left. So what is going to happen with that last episode? I want him to be Captain America. In the last episode, I wanted him to officially be Captain America. I want to see him fighting in the capsule. Don't know if that'll happen, but I want this episode to end with him saying, Right, I'm going to be the next Captain America. Next week is him in the new suit. Fighting John Walker, maybe? Um, I don't know if he's going to fight John Walker again because John Walker's gone. I know, I know. But well, there, there is that, yeah. That might be the end of them, but. I don't know, this is kind of wrapping the series up, but there's yeah. still one episode left. I'm so yeah. happy to hear you say that. So what like else could have been better to last episode? Yeah, I was, about, I was saying, what else could they have in, have in store now that they've effectively okay. wrapped up a lot of these storylines? Seymour's gone to prison. John Walker's story set up for him becoming US agent. Cap and, yeah, Cap, Cap and Bucky have gone their separate ways. Yeah. The boat's, um, the boat's effectively fixed. The only just, thing that's left is just, like Carly and her organization. So maybe that'll be the, maybe that maybe that'll be the main focus of the series finale. Well, I think we're going to find out that Sharon's a power broker, and I think uh, she's been behind it all. Mm. Oh. No point in my life that ever think you wanted to leave. Not even when I was lighting acid at the bank. <laughs> you were so sexy. <laughs> God, I miss you so much. There's a fight out there, and then there's a fight here. And bro, you have taken them both on. So you really gonna let Isaiah Brown get in your head? You gonna let him decide what you do next? Isaiah's been to hell and back. If I was in his shoes, I'd probably feel the exact same way. But what would be the point of all the pain and sacrifice if I wasn't willing to stand up and keep fighting? This um... Oh, okay. That that's that smile though. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh yes. It's montage time, baby! On Rocket. <laughs> oh, now you're just so showing cool. off. 
He's doing like the sig- no, that's the signature Captain America where he does the flipping like Civil War and all that jazz. He does those flips, so he's like trying to like mimic those, which is awesome. Oh, Sam is just so cool, man. Yeah. <laughs> On your left. Oh, what oh, like, it's, oh what please, 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 please. Yeah. There we oh. go. Now we're getting somewhere. Oh, man. This is cool. And, it, and, it's, the, and it, it's the theme for the show in the background as well just mwah, yes yes <laughs> Woo! Oh, love it. yes he did the signature Woo! cap like jump <laughs> he finally did it good <laughs> oh absolutely good. glorious i wonder if he's gonna have the captain america costume I don't think it'll be this episode. I think we, I think the government might come to accept him as Captain America and make him a suit. Well, I don't know. That's Bad Truck. I knew it. Bad Truck from The Winter Soldier. Whoa. It's like, the, it's like the first fight scene of The Winter Soldier where they're on the ship. Oh, yeah. We are the means. George gets to pay back and we get a killer. It's a bargain on both sides. They might be here for a picnic or what? They're just not going to be soft. So I'm back doing new fast before I know someone Uh-oh. We're going to make sure the GRC vote never happens. Yeah, hey, spicy peppers. I'm only here to kill the fuck. You've got your chance. Oh. Oh, mama. That's a development and a half. There's no way they're all going to become... Super <laughs> There's no way they're all gonna be flag smashers. Which would move upwards of 20 million refugees back home to their countries of origin. It's coming during these difficult times of international politics. Sorry, it's been so long. It's been the technical details, but I finally got results from the CNN Mass War, and I think we're on to something. When we look back, all these pings are from places just before the flag smashers hit. Clearly, they're all over in Europe. Earlier today, we got one from New York. Now, I can't promise you I'm using a VPN and asking your location, but... Great I... work, Joaquin. I'll take it from here. Oh, we're going back to New York. The right people will go along right with this. Oh, 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 we do. do. You have to consider the optics. The optics are whatever we show them. We have to and what we're doing to support us. Do we really need to bother with boats? There are troops in place. I can make a call and have the refugees move now. We're not rounding them up like hell. And we still do not have sufficient resources in the resettlement camps. What's sufficient? They can't stay where they are forever. <laughs> no. Oh, boy. Here come the smashes. Oh, what if this is a co- what if this is the costume? What's in now? It is. It's the costume, isn't it? What's what's oh come on, what's in the box? It's the costume, isn't it? They can't end the episode and not show it. 
It's gonna oh, be the come costume. on! It's gonna come be the costume. On! It's gonna be the costume, and it's gonna be made of vibranium. Oh, we have to wait till next week. Come on! That was a good episode. That was good. Oh man! So that so that's gonna be the final episode. The battle in he, New York. He, I'm actually I'm really excited. Oh. After credit scene. Yeah. We got an after credit scene still. Yeah, there is that, yeah. But is it gonna be a oh. mid is it gonna be a mid credit scene or is it gonna be right at the end? Not too sure. We'll like we'll check both so we will just in case. I'm excited though. I'm genuinely I like it. See, whenever I see whenever I see that there's gonna be a battle in New York, I'm like, yes, it's like the one place I love seeing a battle. Yeah. It's a bit cliche though. That they always choose somewhere like LA or New York or, or yeah. Miami, somewhere like that. I think it's because when you associate big battle scenes, you always think of New York. That is they are tomorrow, true. Godzilla, uh, Cloverfield. Yeah, that is that Avengers, is true. Yeah. Like so many films where, um, yeah, day after tomorrow, I think I said, <laughs> but you think of like big disasters, big fight scenes, and all that. Jazz. Yeah. Uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles as well. Things yeah, like that, that. that that's set in New York. It's like you think, oh, New York with big battle scenes. Maybe we're going to see him in costume in the after credit scene. But somebody said that there's there's a cameo supposed to show up. It'd be funny if it was like just. It'd be funny if it was a uh, Blimit Vision showing up. <laughs> like, oh my word! <laughs> it's an actor <laughs> Anthony Mackie's always wanting to work with. That's just like the running gag. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear me. That'd be funny. Here we go. <laughs> yes, there is. Cool. <gasps> oh. Oh, he's making his own shield. Oh, yeah. US agent. Yeah, he's a US agent, man. Wow! I think his shield's black and red because his costume's black and red. That is true. Uh, yeah, that's it. Is there no other after credits? No, no, that's it. Nice. Said he'd become US agent. Wow! Woo. That was very exciting. That was good. Where do we even begin with summing up that episode? What the that was good. What the hell just dropped behind me? Something definitely dropped behind my desk. I'll check. I'll, I'll check that shortly. But wow! What the hell? Where do we even begin with summing up that episode? Yeah, I know that was mad. Yeah, that was good. It was. It was good. I like. I like those kind of episodes. It was like the first episode. I enjoyed that because you just got to see them just do normal things. Quite enjoyed yeah. that. However, I hate the fact that it's taken four episodes to really, really get good. Because yeah. we've only got one episode left and then that's it. I feel like it should have been like an eight episode like series because you've got like half of it where it's just... Yeah. Set up and, yeah, because the last few episodes before episode four were a bit meh. Whereas this is just... It's gotten good now. Finally, he's like <laughs> Captain America and... Next week's episode was yeah, New York, U.S. agent, U.S. agent, the power broker. I reckon. I think Sharon Carter is Sharon Carter is the power broker. Then is confirmed it. It, it. it has to be. It has to be. She's she's the power broker because she called Batrock and said get into these people. So she's a power broker. Um, yeah. Bucky's gonna have to come back to help out. He's go- yeah, he's gonna have to. He's got to. Because now it's like, oh, it's gonna be mad. 
it's going to be good. It's going to be good, though. I'm looking forward to it. It's, yeah. I'm happy to be Sans for actually finally taking up the mantle of Captain America. And I think that's what's in that box is like his Captain America Falcon costume. Yeah, it'll be, and, that, and that'll be the first time we actually get to see that particular costume in action. <laughs> oh, boy. It, it, it's going to be like when we first saw Wanda, like, get her final Scarlet Witch transformation. I think oh, it's gonna be- that, was, that, that, was that was a glorious moment. That was good. And then, yeah, like, it's getting good. Finally. Finally. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's it. Again, yeah. but again, at the end of the day, just like they did with WandaVision, the, the slow burn approach. Yeah. However, because this is only six episodes long, it's felt like the slow burn has been even longer. Yeah, especially given the fact that each of the episodes is like 45 minutes to an hour. Yeah, true. That's true. They have, yeah, they've been more generous in that sense. I, I want Loki to be all out madness. I don't oh, want Loki that to would be more. funny if that was the case. I don't want to. I don't. I don't want Loki to have any stops and starts. I just want it to be complete madness. Because, like, if you're going to do the time vote agency or time variant agency, mm-hmm. um, you've got to go like. So yeah, because it's all time travel. It's that one's going to be crazy. That one's yeah. going to be very like one division. People are going to be speculating things and things like that. But yeah, no, that was good. I really enjoyed that episode. Yeah, I'm excited okay. for next. Yeah. Okay. We've only got another week to wait, folks. But yeah, but yeah. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. If you did, hit the thumbs up. And if you want to be Dream Chasers like us, hit the subscribe button down at the bottom. Click the bell to join the Dream Chasers notification squad so you don't miss anything that we do on this uh, channel. I've got a brand new episode of Kingdom of Isolation coming up uh, over the course of the next week alongside one, possibly two film reviews for 2021. And rest assured, like I said, like I said during this episode, and I'm pretty sure I mentioned it last week as well, Rest assured, I will be reviewing the new Mortal Kombat movie when it comes out next week. Yes. That's it. I, I just have a very, I just have a somewhat extensive list to get through. Uh, the Tom and Jerry film, uh, uh, Judas and the Black Messiah, or whatever it's called, uh, mm-hmm. News of the World. I'm going by UK release date, folks. Uh, Tom and Jerry film, Godzilla versus Kong as yeah. well. So yeah, yeah. so I've, I've I've got a fair few films to get through, um, and of course, uh, yeah. Uh, so yeah, um, we'll we'll see you guys next time. Yes.